Uh, wait, wait, wait. Let me get this straight. You want me to design the album cover for Jagged Stone? My all-time favorite singer? That's right, requested by Jagged Stone himself. I brought a few visuals so you can get a sense of what we're going for. This doesn't seem like Jagged Stone material, more like mm -hmm. a perfume ad. This is the direction of his new image, more modern, current. Really? Wow. I was thinking more along the lines Don't of... think this is what is selling these days. Uh, sure. And one last thing, Marinette. We're in a hurry. We need your proposal by the end of the day. You up to it? Mm. Uh, yeah. Okay. See you later, then. My daughter, famous album cover designer. You're gonna kill it, Marinette style. Booyah! <laughs> hmm. Why does Jagged Stone want to change his style? XY's music is so cold and lifeless, repetitive, mundane, the total opposite of Jagged's. And what I've just done here is, uh, is so not my style either. So why are you doing it then? Because that's what I was asked to do. Maybe you should follow your gut feeling. Do something that's really you. But you heard what Mr. Roth said. This is what's selling these days. Yeah, but Jagged Stone wanted you because of your style. Ah, uh, the pressure! I can't deal! Marinette, superhero of France, defender of the innocent, fighter of all the rights, can't deal with the pressure. <laughs> what happened to the raw, impulsive artistry that made this? Yeah, about that. Mr. Roth told me... Marinette's uh, young, Jag. She represents our target audience. She's come up with a modern concept that's exactly what you need. Doesn't it look a lot like the cover of that YZ guy? Marinette, don't listen to Bob. Could you do another one? You know, Jagged style. Yeah, sure. But I don't know if... You my girl, Marinette. Remember, raw, impulsive artistry. I think we're all done here, Bob. No, we are not! <laughs> yeah. Sabrina will be her deputy. Do we have any other candidates? Mm. Hmm. Yes, Kim? Uh, nothing. I, I'm sorry. I, uh, I, uh, uh the bus, um, <coughs> drive throat. Chloe's running again. She's been class rep since when? Kindergarten? Oh, why don't you run as candidate? You make an awesome representative. No can do. My blog is a full-time job. All right, I'll give all of you until the end of lunch to decide if you'd like to be a candidate. Or I'll tell everyone. I hate that history class that we have to take. Can you believe the homework she's giving us? So what did Chloe say to you this time? She offered to go on a date with you? No, she threatened to tell everyone I'm afraid of spiders. She told me that if I ran for the election, I'd get kicked out of scrapbooking club. And you know how much I love all those stickers, colorful scraps of papers, and gluing. I couldn't care less about being a candidate. And what's your excuse? Well, uh, I'm really busy. With what? Oversleeping? Well, no, but, uh, uh, well, I guess I would run if no one else did. So, are there any new candidates who would like to run against Chloe and Sabrina? <laughs> 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 Given that Chloe and Sabrina are the only candidates, there's no point in voting. So, Chloe and Sabrina... <gasps> I'll run! Wonderful! You'll need to develop your campaign and have a speech ready by tomorrow. We'll have the vote then. So, let's hear the scoop on your campaign. How are you gonna represent? Represent? Uh, I have no idea. I still can't believe I raised my hand. Way to go, Garnet! <laughs> You spoke from the heart. It was truly authentic. <laughs> huh? Oh, uh, thanks. When you win, can we get more comfortable chairs? They're so hard, I can barely concentrate in class. <gasps> Maybe pink ones! And it'd be primo if we could listen to our beats while we study in the library. Uh, you know, um, I don't, you know. Um, <laughs> sure, Julica. Uh, Adrian! Marinette can count on your boat, right? Sure, depending on her speech. Better get cracking on that campaign. I've watched how my daddy wins every election, and I'm going to follow in his footsteps. I know just how to win. By having the best campaign? Ha! 
Whatever. The secret to winning in politics is ruining your opponent's <gasps> reputation. Softer chairs, music in library, whatever Julika said. I'm writing down everyone's issues. Now I'll just have to get all this in my election speech. I'm proud of you. I'm sure you're gonna win. You'll make an awesome class rep. They're all relying on me to defeat Chloe. Even Adrian, do you realize that? <gasps> Marinette battles on. Why? What's going on? Chloe's invited the whole class to her campaign launch party at City Hall, and she's got Jagged Stone coming too. Seriously? Jagged Stone, my favorite star? I love him! Oh, and so does everyone else. Precisely! She's trying to buy student votes with autographs! Not if I have anything to say about it. Meet you there. Hey, Marinette. Weren't you meeting Alia back at school this afternoon to research her term paper? Oh no, I'm late. Again! Actually, the tryouts are for a partner to team up with Max in the tournament. Why Max? Because he's unbeatable. He's a total rock sore. He's got the highest APM over anyone. APM? Actions per minute? This tournament is his whole life. He's been grinding all year to level up. Adrian is now in the lead. What happened, Max? Hmm. Awesome job. We're gonna make a killer combo. Yeah! Yay! Yay! So let me get this straight. If someone manages to beat Max's score, they'll team up with Adrian at the tournament? No one can beat Max. Mm. Or rather, Max and Adrian. It's a slam dunk. They're our school's dream team. Mm. Uh, uh, I see where you're going with this little lady. Just imagine <gasps> teaming with Adrian! Are you out of your mind, girl? This is about stepping up and representing, uh, not snuggling up and snogging. This is serious business! Seriously, Alia, you think I'd actually go through with it? Well, <laughs> I think we have our two champions lined up for the Paris tournament. Wait! Uh, <laughs> is it too late to try out? <gasps> well, the library is closing up in five minutes, but... <laughs> oh, boy. Adrian's joy pad! <gasps> Is she serious? There's no way. Unless the particular player has a particular motivation. The rules are elementary. You battle each other's robots with your own and... Please. Every time you win, you loot his items and gain mm -hmm. XP, which upgrades your mech. I'm not a noob, thank you very much. Ah, uh, sounds like you have a sufficient amount of knowledge. Let's see if it's enough to beat me. Yeah, this will be funny. Uh, seriously? How could anyone spend so much time in front of a screen? I know, as if. <laughs> Come on, Max, you can do it. Quarter circle plus heavy kick and flying oh. hyperstorm. Yeah. Triple hit combo, marinette style. Uh. Booyah! Uh. Woo! Yeah! Woo! Oh. I win! Mm -hmm. What? I can't believe it! She. she beat him? <laughs> beat him? She pulverized him! The king's been knocked up his throne! Yeah! I. Ex 
accept this defeat. I relinquish my position in the tournament. Congratulations, Marinette and Adrian. Max, uh, wait! Max. Look, I'm fine. I lost fair and square, but if you don't mind, I'd like a little solitude. So, Marinette Dupin Cheng and Adrian Agrest will represent Francois Dupont High School at the Paris Ultimate Mecha Strength Free <laughs> Tournament. Good luck to both of you. Well, I guess I'll be coming over to practice with my new partner. See you uh, later. See ya. Now you gotta win, Em. You're gonna be representing the school, not just hanging out with Adrian. Oh, Adrian. Oh, brother. I don't know which I liked more, the show or sitting next to my sweet Adrian! Maybe you should give him a call and ask him out to a movie. Speaking of calling, there's something I've got to tell you, Alia. I accidentally erased your ladybug video on your phone, and then when I tried to fix the problem, I dropped your phone in a dumpster, and now it stinks. Like, bad. Like, really, really bad, and I'm sorry. So, so, so sorry! I know how much that video meant to you, and I'm the lamest of friends. Lamer than lame! <laughs> Chillax, lady. If there's anyone on this earth who knows about your legendary hmm. clumsiness, it's me, your BFF. So, you're not angry? Well, <laughs> you should have just come clean and told me in the first place, but no, we're cool. Besides, I uploaded the video onto my lady blog before I showed it to you. I'm so <laughs> lucky to have a friend like you. Now that we're good, you probably don't care about the surprise I planned for you. <gasps> screw up or no screw up, you know I love surprises! Okay, you see that theater over there? There's something inside for you, on the stage. Hello! Alia, right? <gasps> Last time I saw you, I was in a hurry, but I've got a bit more time now if you want to interview me for your lady blog. Ah, uh, no. Seriously? Do I? Do I? Have a seat. You don't know me, but FYI, this is like the biggest moment of my life. <laughs> Ali is lucky to have you as a friend too, you know. Well, show me! Only after I put it on my blog. There's no way I'm gonna lose this video. Hey! <laughs> 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 